When it comes to caravans, I think it's safe to say they divide opinion. Some people absolutely love them. That wonderful sense of travel, great outdoors and adventure. But when it comes to what they look like, some people absolutely hate them. Is it possible to create a really cool caravan? One person thinks it is. Inspired by his job, HGV driver Chris has a plan to take caravans where you'd never have thought they could go. With the coolest, cleverest, most unique conversion yet, to create a head-turning caravan to take his wife Jody and their kids Maya and Logan on outdoor adventures. Our kids' holidays are always camping. We used to camp in a tent until uh, the kids burst our airbeds for the third time running. They want to upgrade their camping experience, having grown tired of burst airbeds. And the opportunity came when something else broke. Chris blew the engine up twice in his T4. So we ended up buying a donor T4 the second time to use the engine out of. Then we decided, well, instead of wasting the van and chopping it up and selling it into pieces, we may as well make use of it and make it into a caravan. With £4,000 to convert this shell, this build could create the ultimate family holiday home on Wales. So you're an HGV driver? Yeah. And in effect, rather than buying a caravan, you're creating, like, a mini HGV, really, aren't you? Yeah. Pickup truck. Yeah. And then another vehicle. Yeah. Stitched onto the back of it. Yes. Have you planned it out beautifully in lots of detail? Yeah, in my head. <laughs> <laughs> you haven't done any drawings? No. He tried. He, yeah, did, he did actually sit yeah, down was, with pen and paper it and, and it just looked like two three, boxes. Three, yeah, like three <laughs> rectangles and some measurements <laughs> in between. It could look absolutely awesome. It could look rubbish. <laughs> it could fall off the back. <laughs> it's a way for Chris to sleep if it doesn't work. <laughs> Chris has turned a 20-year-old wreck headed for the knacker's yard into a sleek, black, cool-as-you-like caravan. Good morning. Morning. I can't believe it. You've done it. That is unbelievable. It's different, isn't it? Mate, it's beautiful, man. Are you pleased with it? Yeah, Very, yeah. yeah. I have to pinch myself a little bit. I'm not surprised. I mean, that looks like a brand spanking new vehicle. Everything just beeps in this thing. It's like driving a transformer. <laughs> <laughs> right, OK, ready? Come on, George. Keep going. Keep going. Slow down. A bit more. Come on. Go on, are you sure? Keep going. <laughs> Locked and loaded. That's one ingenious articulated caravan lorry done. I'm loving the rope. Look at that. That's VIP treatment, that is. My name's not down, though. No. <laughs> Inside, Chris has turned the style up to 11, seamlessly mixing touches of star glamour with relaxed family vibes. Clever space-saving design creates a comfortable double bed for him and Jordy to kick back in style. And their kids' quarters are way more comfortable than their old airbeds. I knew you'd do a great job on the outside. In fact, you've done a thousand times better job on the outside than even I thought you were going to do. Thank you. But inside, the detail is just immaculate, isn't it? And everything's nicely lined out. Loads of storage. Loads of storage, yeah. These are neat, aren't they? Yeah. Oh, look at that. I love the way that you've gone for the thin glass on the front as well. Yeah. Yeah. Tiny little details like that just make it look more streamlined. Yeah. It's absolutely brilliant. I love the tech. We've crammed quite a lot in there. LED lights, I can change the colour of it, and it can be controlled on my phone. Controlled by your phone? You can yeah. do a disco with the do lights Do a disco well. with the lights. Even just that, I mean, I know that's fairly standard stuff now, but <laughs> people don't normally put them in vehicles. And it's got Bluetooth speakers uh, on the inside and on the outside here. And we've got underfloor heating of them on a campsite. Have you? Yeah. Shut up. No. <laughs> You've gone well posh. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what, this must turn some heads when it's out on the road. It does, yeah. You find people's heads against the glass of their vehicles <laughs> that are going past. <laughs> Literally, like that. Literally right against the glass. <laughs> I mean, it is one of the most unusual campers I think I've ever seen in my life. Chris's unique vision for an articulated camper van has bowled me over. But I'm not the one he has to impress. What do you guys think of it? Amazing. Amazing. That is the right word. <laughs> and I didn't even have to pay you to say it. 